I just wanted to make this quick video apologizing to you guys in advance and I guess even for my lack of effort in my recent videos, just recently. I'm gonna say I'm gonna be real man because I always pride myself on being real and let me remind you, let me just remind you right now that this is the only time I've ever, ever, ever done this and it will be the only time I've ever done this because that means I would have been playing you guys and playing myself. So, in episode 7, that was a shitty workout. At the end of that episode, I was talking about how shitty that workout was. And even in yesterday's replay, I was talking about how shitty that workout was. I was going to just go home and scrap the video because I just wasn't feeling it that day. But then instead, I just recorded just the sets I needed to make a video out of it so I can make sure I get a video up the next week. I was going to just scrap it and say, you know what, I'm not going to put out the video. But I said, you know what, let me just put the video out just to show you guys that I'm going to remain staying true to who I am and staying true to what I believe in on YouTube. So I just feel like a lot of the passion that I have for fitness left, but it wasn't really the passion for fitness that left. It was that I was, it was becoming consumed when being paired up with YouTube, as in every workout I, I did was recorded. I never had those times to myself to just train in my own element, if you will. Just train by myself and do my thing. All of my best workouts have been off camera. Not saying I don't like recording my workouts and sharing with you guys. I like doing it. But... When you start doing every single workout on, on camera and showing the world every single workout that you do, it's too much to focus on sometimes, right? Some people can't even ha some people can't even deal with hearing the noise from the gym. They put music in their ears. I have to deal with you know using the camera, and again, using the camera is not a problem. It just becomes a problem when every single workout, from the workouts I do outside to in the gym to every single workout being on camera. So you're always, you're always focused on two things. You're always focusing on making the video while trying to make your gains. So I just decided that you know what, I'm stepping my, I'm stepping my game up. I'm stepping my intensity up. I'm going to show you guys that shitty workout. I'm going to show you guys how I was about to play you guys in that episode only. And I'm just going to start, since I'm only showing two workouts a week anyway, I'm just going to record two workouts a week. I work out four times a week, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Sunday. Sunday is the calisthenics day. That's the calisthenics and power building with calisthenics, right? But I haven't done those days yet because I was like, if I just can't record it and I don't, I don't know how to record it yet, then why record, then why go and do the workout? So I'll skip it. I'm not doing that anymore. I'm not basing my workouts around whether I can record it or not. I'm not doing that anymore because it's sucking it's sucking the passion out of it. Right? It's sucking the passion out of it. Today I'm not recording. Today is deadlift day. It's Wednesday. This if I were, if I were to record today, it would be going up next Thursday. Right? I'm not doing it. I'm not recording. I'm just going to go to the gym by myself, do my deadlifts and just enjoy it. Just enjoy it and go home and not tell you guys how it went. It's just it's just me. And I'm gonna be doing that from now on. Not for every deadlift session, but for, for two sessions a week. I'm just going to keep it between me and myself. Just that's it. In terms of my diet, my diet, I'm actually not making excuses for my diet. I'm, I'm actually legit broke right now. Even when I get my next paycheck, let's just say it's the end of the month. So adults know what I'm talking about. It's the end of the month, and my paycheck isn't going to be that big. So when it comes to my diet, it hasn't been on point because I can't afford it to be on point. People say, just buy rice. Just buy rice. I buy rice. I have rice. But no one's going to eat rice every single meal. So I eat what I can. I eat what I can. And when my money starts going back up, I'll get back on track with my diet a lot, a lot better than I have now. So, yeah, just... I apologize, I thank you guys for supporting still, and I'm just going to do what feels right for me, I can't, I can't base my entire life off YouTube, I can't, it, be, it, it just becomes too much, it becomes too much, not, not, 
not much of like a problem necessarily, but a distraction. And I just need to get back into my element. I have to find my passion again. And I can't share every single workout that I possibly do. And share every single meal that I possibly eat on YouTube. So yeah. Thank you for the support. And I'll talk to y'all next time. Stay blessed. Done.